you can see here, we're starting this video off at Silcox Funland, Southport Pier. I've just stood here and watched it open. It's bang on nine o'clock and it has just opened. It is Tuesday the 9th of January. It's a pretty chilly morning. It's about zero degrees now. We've just done a little walk down by the beach. I will link that video down below for you. But now in this video, we're gonna head into the city centre and have a little wander around Southport. I say city centre, it's not a city, is it? But uh, into the centre of Southport. It's pretty bright there. The sun has just risen. Sun rises about at half eight. We'll head down here. I have not been into Southport Centre for a long, long time. When I was a kid, just cross this road. When I was a kid with uh, my parents, my mum and dad, we would come to Southport every single Saturday, have a little wander around the shops, and then we would always go to the Bold Hotel, which is on the end of Lord Street, and have lunch there. Good times, nice memories. Um, in fact, Stephen, my son, when he was a bit younger, when he was very young, my parents used to look after him because I would work on a Saturday, they would do the same with him. Let's head down into the centre, see what it's like on this cold Tuesday morning. Down this street here, there is loads of like amusement arcades and like candy floss shops and where you can get rock and things in the summer. I assume, I mean, they're all closed now. I don't know whether they do open up at all in January. I can't imagine it's probably worth their while, to be honest. I imagine they're pretty seasonal kind of places. Like Funland has just opened on the front, but I can't imagine all of these open. I don't know. Well, that lady's going to open up that ice cream parlor. Maybe they do open, maybe it's just a little bit early yet. So this is Lord Street, kind of the main street, the main shopping street in Southport. All looks quite run down, to be honest. Although this building, HSBC. That's an impressive building. Wayfarer's Shopping Arcade is always beautiful at Christmas. I assume they will have just taken down all their Christmas decorations, but it usually looks so nice at Christmas time. There's also a nice tree in here. Yeah, that's where the tree is. Upper level. I did bent some booth rides. I remember going in that shop when I was a kid. But yeah, there's nothing much. Nothing much here anymore. Let's head out. 
music playing. Hopefully I don't get copyright strikes for that. <laughs> we'll wander down Lord Street a little bit, but yeah, most of the shops seem to have gone. It's all a bit, what's the word? Kind of like things are a bit sort of derelict and sort of falling apart a little bit, which is a shame. Goodness. A seagull. I sure it was a seagull. Just pooed. It nearly landed on my head. <laughs> that was lucky. <laughs> Goodness me. So many of these shops, just not shops anymore. Southport does have some amazing old buildings though. I don't know what that building is there. Maybe it's the library, I think. No, I think maybe the library's over there. I'm not sure. Look at this building, the old bank, it's now the Gemini Lounge, look at these pillars, insane, on this famous hotel, well I think it's famous, the Skysbrook Hotel. I think we'll do is we'll head across the road here. I'll be back when we've crossed the road. <laughs> okay, we've crossed we've crossed the road now. Southport Rotary Club wishing well. A little wish in there. Nice open space. Is there water? No, there's not. There's a place where there's like water fountains somewhere in the south part, I think. I can't quite remember. Pavilion. See the Scaresbrook Hotel from across the road. And we'll head up through through to the, what is now, I think it's East Bank, no it's not East Bank Street, but it's the pedestrian section of Southport, where to be honest, kind of, Lord Street, the shops that used to be in Lord Street, they kind of moved away from Lord Street into this kind of pedestrian bit now, so it's usually the bit more busier bit of Southport. This big building, it was the library, or is the library, Atkinson Library, it's like an art centre, museum type thing. Oh. Quarter past nine. Right, let's head down to the pedestrian bit. This road is called East Bank Street. I knew that somewhere was East Bank Street. This one. And then, yeah, the, the pedestrian one is Chapel Street. We'll head down, have a little wander, see how busy it is in the middle of Southport on a Tuesday morning at quarter past nine.
Not as many shops here as I remember, to be honest. <laughs> Lots of them have gone as well. Here's Southport train station. It's all pretty run down to be honest. Maybe it's the weather, <laughs> the time of year, maybe in the sunshine it looks nicer. Well there we go, there is Southport. I'm going to end this video here. If you do want to see our beach walk, check that out down below. Thanks for watching and I will see you soon. Bye.